sub plus D is the School of Architecture Planning and Design. And the School of Architecture Planning and Design at UM6P is actually a unique uh, school. Why? Because it's combining three main areas of expertise of architecture, planning, and design. And uh, this school is centered around four main principles in its uh, programs of education, research, development, and innovation. It has these uh, four uh, principles, which is the first one, smart, smart solutions around buildings and built environment. Human-centered, I think architecture and planning should serve, first of all, the human factor. And the other thing that is so important, this school is dealing with all the problems within a multi-scale uh, dimension. Why multi-scale? We are not dealing with one building at the scale of one to 100 or at the territorial scale of one to 2,000. So therefore, we are dealing actually from the, 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 the building to the district, to the city, to the region, and to the territory. It's multi-scale and it's also around sustainability and resilience. The graduates of this school, they would be very efficient as builders, as designers, as people of creative mind, and they are very critical in order to plan and design within a critical context like the one of uh, Morocco. School of Architecture, Planning and Design give us new, new ways of learning and the innovative skills in order to, to improve uh, where we live without forgetting what's been done and uh, the soul of uh, everything that's around us. The School of Architecture, Planning and Design, SAPLOS D, its ecosystem is very innovative, which is the uh, Mohammed VI Polytechnic University. I think we are so proud of being within this academic prestigious setting of UM6P that provides us with an interdisciplinary dimension from agriculture, from resilience of the landscape, to materials and nanotechnology and smart materials, to the experimental mine, to the experimental farm that we have, to the industrial uh, plantations, and all of that within a vehicle, which is the green and smart city of Ben Greer. This green and smart city itself is a living lab for a school like ours, which is the School of Architecture, Planning and Design. And I think that hands-on, learning by doing through those living labs of OCP projects, the projects of the campus itself, that the school was highly involved in tailoring, designing its physical campus, in addition to the different projects that are in the green cities. So our students, they are so lucky eh, to find that the school has an ecosystem of experimentation. And this is the future of architecture. It's not just about aesthetic play, but rather to experiment ideas and move forward to the future. Architecture is a very inspiring profession and it needs to be practiced in an even more inspiring environment. And the School of Architecture, Planning and Design of Ben Greer provides that since it uh, encourages its individuals of, uh, by learning um, and acquiring the knowledge and the skills needed for planning the smart and human-centered cities, since human is uh, in the heart of our every reflection. To cut the story short, I think the School of Architecture, Planning and Design has three, out three or four outcomes. One, train future architects and planners to be more efficient, to be more responding to the human needs rather than to respond to the ego of the architect. Number two, I think technology and engineering and how our students, they are not just a, a mere superficial uh, copy-paste of solutions, but they can through startups and through uh, incubation to devise their own solutions within our laboratories of the university. One can may say why architects, they need to go to innovation. I think it's the time. Building industry throughout history was always a vehicle of finding solutions for structural systems from materials. And they think the building should not just be uh, dwelling into the architecture or design per se, but they need to move to these uh, technical solutions. I think the third outcome, the School of Architecture Planning at UM6P, it's not only training future architects, but also helping the practicing existing architects 
to equip themselves with updated tools to be more efficient in a very changing market. I am very happy and proud to be a student that is going to witness the birth of the green and smart city of Benguer, since it's a very important thing to have uh, this project in our country. As a student, I think it's important for me to, to see to see how, how it works and to maybe to help and give ideas and, and see how things are changing and how we can actually build something smart and eco-friendly. The School of Architecture Planning and Design can be a vehicle to serve a whole continent to, to, to meet its new challenges and the challenges are numerous. <laughs>